Hey, what's going on? Ben Kaiser here with another episode of Data Jargon here at jobsinthefuture.com. And today we're going to talk about Apache Hadoop and what is Apache Hadoop and data analytics. Well, first of all, uh, it is not a database, not a new coding language, and it is not a cloud server. What it is, uh, in a very simple sentence, Hadoop is an application that utilizes available server space to distribute across multiple servers. So it distributes your data across multiple servers in order to create a mean time to failure system and speed up the processing speed of data analysis. So that is a very simple uh, explanation of it, but if you want to get a little more info, we're going to break that uh, sentence down so you can understand each part of it. First of all, we're going to talk about how Hadoop utilizes available server space to store and distribute data. So basically Hadoop is a program uh, that sits on top of a cluster of servers. So multiple servers tied together either via uh, in, your, you know, in your building or on a cloud uh, computing system. So in order to create high performance single server, you would have to pour tons and tons of RAM, memory, and drive into one server. And the problem with that is, is it's extremely expensive. And there's no backup to that system. So Hadoop doesn't utilize that single system. What it does is it distributes data across multiple server space. This creates um, a good fail safe for you. Um, now, by spreading the load across multiple servers, it makes uh, data retrieval speeds skyrocket. So think about it. If you have uh, email addresses on server A, phone numbers on server B, and home addresses on server three, um, if everybody's going for those, you're not going to have a problem because they're all going to be pulling from different servers. But if all of those are contained on one server, you have everybody in the company going to that single server and trying to pull data, which will greatly slow it down. All right, secondly, Hadoop distributes data across multiple servers in order to create a mean time to failure system, which is an MTTF for short. Uh, now, let's say you have a very large data set of emails, hundreds of thousands of emails, and uh, you're an online store and you're going to be promoting your products uh, on Black Friday. Now, the day before Black Friday, your server goes down. Say you have a single server, your server goes down. Um, now, you are unable to send out an email to your email list, and that could lose you potentially millions of dollars. But if you're using a Hadoop, what it is is it's spreading that data across multiple clusters, multiple servers, multiple databases. So if it senses one going down, it can shift the data, and you can still have access to that crucial data that you need to market to your email list. So what it does is it creates an extremely... Uh, fail safe system, which is excellent in the data analyst world. All right, the ability to process data is faster using Hadoop. So because Hadoop uses a cluster to store data, there is more computing power to establish faster processing. Hadoop also uses a technique known as MapReduce. So what MapReduce does is it maps out the data, then breaks it down, so reduces it into smaller counterparts in order for you to go in and be able to pull the data in a far quicker way. All right, now if you want to know more about MapReduce and kind of have a full tutorial, uh, we have a video on that here at jobsinthefuture.com. Go check out our channel and you can view that. Um, but for now, we're sticking with uh, Hadoop. So speed is improved because of data availability. When the data is spread across multiple databases, it can be accessed very quickly. Now, don't confuse data extraction with processing uh, of analyzing. Um, Hadoop is a fantastic resource to house data for quick extraction, but it is not how you analyze data. Uh, if you're looking to come up with a, a system to view data to achieve valuable insights, you want to combine Hadoop with something like Tableau or OpenRefine. All right, now adding a Hadoop certification to your data analytics Toolbox is a huge benefit to you in the job market. So head on over right now, jobsinthefuture.com. We have a great course recommendation that can make you a top-notch expert on Hadoop. Uh, for now, thank you for watching this video. If this has helped you at all, please hit the like button, subscribe to our YouTube channel to not miss out on a single video. And we'll see you here next time, jobsinthefuture.com.